Senator Gerba. Thank you, Madam Chair, Madam Speaker, rather. As Senator Clément said, we all cried on Monday when we said au revoir to Senator Jaffer. I'll try not to cry now today. I rise today to pay tribute to my African sister, Senator Mobina Jaffer. She is the first African of South Asian descent, and you've all said that, and the first Muslim woman to be appointed to the Senate of Canada. When I was appointed to this august chamber, I rushed to read the careers of all senators. That's how I realized that I was not the first African-born senator in Canada. But when I spoke to senators and friends about Senator Jaffer, those who are not familiar with the multi-ethnic and racial diversity of the African continent, many of them have told me that Senator Jaffer cannot be considered African because she is, of, she is not black because she is of South Asian descent. Yes, once again, this testif testifies to the poor understanding of Africa, which many people think is made up only of black people. I only had to talk to Senator Jaffer, however, to see how proud she is of her Ugandan and African heritage. Honorable colleagues, we can leave Africa no matter how, no matter what the conditions, but Africa never leaves us. Arriving in Canada as a refugee, the Honorable Jaffer has dedicated her career to representing and advocating on behalf of all Canadians, especially those who, like her, have found a new home in this country of immigration. She arrived as a refugee, but she did everything she could, everything. I won't repeat everything that uh, has been said already. For 23 years, Senator Jaffer has used her unique story and powerful voice, a warm voice, to inspire and influence policies that have shaped our country so that this Canada that we all love could become more inclusive and diverse. Thank you.